Hello everyone, and welcome back to our universe. Today we'll be talking about the phases of the moon. Each month our moon passes through eight phases. These phases are named after how much of the sun we can actually see, and whether the amount visible is increasing or decreasing each day. It takes our moon about 29 and a half days to complete one cycle, and this goes through all of the eight phases. Occasionally though, there are two full moons in the same month, and this happens about once every 2.7 years. This is referred to as the blue moon. So let's look at the names and the descriptions of the phases of the moon. The new moon. This is when the side of the moon facing the earth is not illuminated. And additionally, the moon is actually up during the day and down throughout the night. And for this reason, we can't actually see the moon during this phase. Waxing Crescent. During this phase, part of the moon actually begins to show. This is usually viewed as a small strip of the moon, a kind of lunar sliver. And this can be seen each evening for a few minutes just after sunset. We say that the moon is actually waxing because each night a little bit more of the moon is actually visible for just that little bit longer. The first quarter. During the first quarter, half of the moon is visible and this is usually for the first half of the evening. Then it eventually goes down, leaving the sky very dark. Waxing gibbous. When most of the moon is actually visible, we say that it is a gibbous moon. If you're actually observing the moon, you can actually see near enough a full moon, apart from a little portion. During this phase, the moon actually remains in the sky for most of the night. The full moon. When we observe the entire face of the moon, it is called, of course, the full moon. A full moon will actually rise just as the evening begins and will actually set about the time when the morning starts up. So when it's a full moon, it actually stays around for a full night. Waning gibbous. The difference between the waning and the waxing is basically the amount of moon that we can see. We begin to see, of course, less and less of the moon each night. And this is what the word waning means. The last quarter. During the last quarter moon, we can actually see half of the moon's lightened surface. That is simply it, but I would say it's probably my most favorite phase of the moon because you can get some great photographs. Waning Crescent. And finally, during the waning crescent moon, observers on Earth can actually see a small sliver of the moon only just before the morning. Each night, less of the moon is visible for less time. And of course, the next one would be back again to the new moon, and the cycle would start again. So, I hope that's given you a great insight into the phases of the moon, and of course, the name of these phases, and of course, what exactly do these phases look like. And as always, if you've enjoyed the video, click the like button, and if you want to support the channel, click subscribe. Thank you for watching.